Let's go to space! Tameranian fire air. What? Uh, your planet's air is made out of hot sauce! It ensures the weak do not survive. You will grow accustomed to the burning. The pain! <laughs> oh, do not die so quickly, friends. We have just arrived. There are so many more wonderful things to see. <laughs> Greetings, friends. Hey. Uh, what up? Hey, Starfire! Welcome home! What's in the basket? Items I have been gathering for a special Tamaranian tradition that I hope you will all participate in. It is very similar to your Thanksgiving. Delicious food and special friends. Oh, please tell me you will join me. Uh, no. I'll eat whatever you make. Oh, I have the happiness. It means so much to me that you will all join in my people's ancient tradition. Guess I'll fire up the grill. What's on the menu? Only the finest space cuisine. Glurk scales, fried fish legs, and my favorite, mouthworms. You know what? I totally forgot. It's my baby cousin's birthday today. Mine too. Oh, yeah? Does she live downtown near the movie theater? Uh, she does indeed. Kabu! <laughs> Raven, would you care for a mouthworm? Uh, no. I'll be in my room trying to forget I ever saw that. I'll try one, Star. Oh, joy! Now these are best when eaten raw. So, uh, I just, uh, ate the whole thing, huh? Yes. So, like, like the whole thing in my mouth? Yes, the whole thing. Yeah, okay. okay. Uh, uh, down the hatch. Everybody. Except for that one. Her. Oh, bleh. Yes, the her herself. Hey, Robin, you miss me? Uh, no, because you are evil. And I'm only attracted to niceness and sweetness and innocent things like a puppy with ears too big for his head. <laughs> Star, can I talk to you a minute? Oh! Can you believe Blackfire has come to see me? Is that not wonderful? Every time you let her into your life, she crushes you. But I do not think this time... No! She is one of the most wanted criminals in the galaxy, Star. Mm-hmm, girl. That girl is bad girl news, girl. She's up to something. And, ugh, bleh. Stop it! All I have ever wished for is to have the sister relationship. And Blackfire knows. If she lets me down again, it will break my heart. And darkness will ooze from it, contaminating the river of my soul. Then filled with the poison, I will rain death and destruction upon all the creatures of the universe! Starting with... Hey, sis. Let's dye your hair so we can be twinsies. Ooh, I always wanted to be the twinsies. <laughs> Sister, fun time! <laughs> You look 
great, sweetie, but it's really missing something. What is it that is missing? I know. Oh, that's such a great color for you. There is something of meaning I wish to relay to you. I have dreamed of us. Can it wait? That's Blackfire, the one you're looking for! Bye-bye, <laughs> sweetie. I lost you before I had the chance to tell you all the things in my heart. Robin! Oh, no, 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 no. The moment I laid eyes on you, I knew. Robin? Is that a kitty? Uh, uh, yes, it is. But as I was saying. Kitty! Oh, so sweet. Oh, tiny nose. Tiny nose. Uh, Starfire, if you can forget about the cat for a second, I'm in the middle of professing my love. <laughs> to call you Nibbles. Hey, Starfire! Eyes over here! Yo, yo, yo! Oh, Mr. Nibbles! Oh, you are a sweet boy! Oh, yes, you are! Never mind. Wow, this place is amazing. Give us the tour, Star. We want to see all the things that made you such a sweet little cuddle bug. As a Tamaranian princess, this palace was my home. <laughs> We often entertained kings, queens, and warlords in an effort to keep the peace of the galaxy. This is General Thraxis of the Blood Dominion. We are working on a very important treaty with him now. What up, General? Uh, what was that about? Oh, on Tamaran, a handshake is the most violent declaration of war. He has vowed to wipe out my people and turn Tamaran into intergalactic gravel. My bad! That is the all right. But you must excuse me. I need to rally a planetary defense. <laughs> Charge! You have to shake everyone's hand? I'm a friendly guy. What do you want me to do? <laughs> This is not what I was expecting. I'm not sure I like Starfire's planet. It's definitely not as sweet as she is. True, but it's pretty cool watching those blob guys explode. <laughs> there goes one. Why does everything burn on this planet? A thing! So we all get our own vehicles? Cool! Wait to try out Wonder Woman's invisible jet! Okay, let's see here. Uh, how do I... Hmm, guess I'll just pull this. Oops. Um, maybe this one? Oh! Yikes. Okay, okay. I, I got it now, I think. Oops, sorry! Whoa! I, uh, oh, one second! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't right. I guess we'll ride with you, then. Everyone squeeze in. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go. So this is Apocalypse. Ooh, wow. Incredible. Where's Marshall Man on it? Still in the invisible jump, bro. Can you at least shut the door? It is shut, see? <laughs> Close it. Close it. You're out of invisible toilet paper, Mama. 
This is the most dangerous planet in the universe. To save the Justice League, we'll have to use all our powers together. Batman, you... Batman? I'm Batman. I need you to... Where'd he go? I'm Batman. Listen, I just need you... Stop disappearing dramatically! What was that? I'm Batman. Stay still and listen! I can't. I'm Batman. Say I'm Batman one more time. I dare you. I double dare you. I'm Batman. Oh, you just got B. Arthur, son. Thanks, B. Is there nothing your deadpan sass can't fix? No. I followed them all day, just waiting for that thing to mutate into the giant spider we'll end up fighting on the other side of the galaxy. But no dice. He's a more fiendish opponent than I thought. Or Perry's just a friendly parasite, and you're a creepy guy in the bushes with a camera. Hmm, creepy camera guy. No! I am certain this will be the best feast day ever. Perry would like to make a toast. He says he would like to thank you for welcoming him into your home. Uh, I'd like to make a toast, too. We've got to separate that thing from you before it kills you! Take it easy! Perry doesn't exist! Don't you see? He's a figment of Starfire's imagination! It has got to go! He is never leaving, Robin. We are the best friends! Well, if parasites are so great, then everyone should have one. Good thing I brought some for the occasion. Uh, what are you doing? Apparently, I'm making friends. Oh, this is so great. Yeah, I love sharing my nutrients. I love how weak they make me feel. Why didn't I get a parasite years ago? Stop it! Just stop! Perry is the only thing that makes me feel normal. Nice going, dude. <laughs> Someone call a doctor. Yeah, bro. We got this survival stuff down. It's easy peasy. <laughs> what? <laughs> really? You all feel that way? Yeah, Absolutely. Okay. Oh, yeah. yes. All right. Since you're all master survivalists, then I guess we can skip to the final challenge. I've called down an alien big game hunter who will stalk us relentlessly until he's collected all of our skulls as trophies. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You called an alien skull collector. Are you crazy, man? We're doomed. He's gonna take my skull! I love my skull! It's my favorite skull. Titans, listen, the only way to survive is... By working together. No! Haven't you listened to anything I've said? We scatter, every man for himself. The alien will pick you off one by one until only I am left standing. Yeah, we should work together. Yo, I think we could beat them if we act as a team and use the survival lessons we learned today. You learn nothing! I'm getting out of here. Ah! You won't take our skulls! Until you've tried some of this delicious coconut curry. Oh. Bro, your gear is pretty fresh. But how about a cake? Ooh, it compliments your mandibles. Hey, come on. Let's survive. Island style. <laughs> you really
really have to go? You will be dear in our hearts for all time, alien hunter. So long, buddy. Here, take some curry for the road, bro. I'm gonna miss that dude. Hey, anyone seen Robin? Is he not magnificent? Why are you so happy about this? It is an honor to prove one's bravery on Tamaran. So how many people have survived Gridna? None! That is why it is such an honor! <laughs> None, Star? Well, he's never faced the Teen Titans. Titans, go! <laughs> None of what you're saying is right! You might as well be telling me that the sun is the moon. We knows the difference between the sun and the moon, fool. And we know more things about the moon, like how those dudes landed on it that one time. Please don't recite your twisted version so, of it. So, there were these space dudes, and they were all up in the Apollo Creed spaceship. It was the Apollo 11. Stop interrupting, Robin. History is important. Like I was saying, the Apollo Creed landed on the moon. That's one small step for men's, and one giant leap for men's kind, yo! from kicking out the jams, I gotta get this helmet off. Wait, there's no air up here. That's crazy, there's air everywhere. It's air. Mmm, smell that good moon breeze. Oh, fresh. I'm smelling something. What is it? Cheese! You seriously think the moon is made out of cheese? Of course not, dude. The moon's not made of cheese. It's got cheese oceans. Oh, too much cheese. I don't feel so good. Oh, bro, me neither. Uh-oh. Our toots are too strong for the moon's low gravity. If we don't stop, we'll shoot into space. I can't stop. I ate too much cheese. Who's that? It's the man on the moon! Hey! <laughs> Sticky Joe! Joe! If it wasn't for everyone's favorite bohemian, Sticky Joe, those brave space dudes would have been lost forever. Wow, I never knew that. That's the really Sticky amazing. Joe is the man in the moon. You don't know anything about history. This was a waste of time. Just give me my hat back. Here you go. I think you need both hands, bro. <laughs> Aww, <laughs> <laughs> hey, Lacorn. <laughs> Whoa, what's going on? Just legging it up, cankle style. Yeah, 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 yeah! Dig on these juicy calves, mama! I thought we agreed to put the legs away. We attempted to put away the legs, but they refused. Also, I was hungry. Hungry? Look at these hams! Don't tell me they don't look delicious. This is what I warned you about. You're using your legs improperly, and they're taking control of you. Actually, we were just following your lead, Raven. Yeah, you used your legs to jump higher than Robin. And you enjoyed the glamour of legging it about town with us. But I... But, 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 What's that, Mama? But, 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 but? 
Heaven comes! What's come over you? You have to stop. Try to stop us, Mama! It. I call upon the League of Legs to disband. We would be happy to, if you can prove you're still strong enough to lead the League of Legs. A challenge? A jumping contest. If you win, we'll go back to being the Titans. But if I win, you're out of the League. Forever. No way. What? Don't have the thickest thighs on the block anymore? Are you the chicken? You certainly have the legs of such a bird. <laughs> Fine. I accept your challenge. Good luck. You'll need it. Because I've got a leg up on this competition. Watch and learn. <laughs> Beat that. How? Impossible. Tsk, tsk, tsk. I used to think it was all about them legs. But now I realize it's all about these legs. Your legs, they're becoming evil. Oh, yeah, sure, right. Look at them. We don't take orders from you anymore, Lady Legacies. Or should I say, Raven? You remember our deal? Come on, you guys. Let's stretch our legs. Glad you like it. Uh, you think you could give me a makeover? I hate my look. I hear somebody who's not happy with himself, but who should be, because he's great. Aw, thanks. So, Robin. Please, call me Mr. Butt. You've earned it. I wish you were my sister, sister. Starfire's gonna be so proud of you. Hey, she's back! Star? Are you okay? I'm here for the her. Blackfire, remember the lessons. Starfire, sweetie, you have never done anything for me except use me and trick me and get me into trouble. I hear you and I'm sorry. It's too late for the sorry. <laughs> You could use a hug. <laughs> this would look great on you. I am not falling for the act again. Wait. I've got something to show you. The dolly you stole from me as a child? Blackfire, where did you get it? I've had it the whole time. I shouldn't have taken it, and I shouldn't have kept it. Starfire, I'm sorry. You really have changed. Yes, I have. Well, so have I. So what happened? <laughs> we worked things out. We're in an alien rock monster's belly. What's not to love? Look, is that a half-eaten hot dog? Oh. 
not a hot dog, but I've never tasted anything like it before. Mm, it's so nice and warm in here, like a free sauna. Getting a good sweat on, detoxing. If Star survived so long because of her positive attitude, then we have to think like her. You know what that means. Titans! Check a war! without seeing things the Tamaranian way, Star. Now do you understand why I love this planet so? I think we do, Star. Then perhaps you will let me show you more of Tamaran. Are you crazy? Let's get out of here. Worst place ever. Blah! Don't worry, Star. This won't hurt a bit. Robin, what are you doing to Perry? It's for your own good. Hey, Robin. You can talk. Yep, I communicate through brainwaves just like Starfire said. Who feels like a jerk now? Guess I should have made an effort to understand you. It's not me you need to do a better job of understanding. Oh, Starfire. Wow, you really are the greatest. Here, to show you there's no hard feelings, I made you a cape. But we're inside my brain. It's a cape for your brain, dum-dum. Oh, cool. You talk to him? Sorry, Starfire. Your traditions may be strange, but sometimes I guess I'm not the normal one. More than sometimes, Robin. What's wrong, Perry? Do you have to leave? Goodbye, Perry. Don't leave, man. I'm gonna miss you so bad. That's awkward. I always cherish my brain cape. <laughs> I love you. Ha! Yes! What did I say? I knew it. I knew it. I knew it all along. You fools just wouldn't listen. I was right and you were wrong. Joy! That was the most enjoyable of videos. Another, please. <laughs>